Hello, my fellow art lovers, and welcome to KJ Comic Art. KJ here with a brand new speed paint featuring the main, the main male character, Ishii Noritaka, from my manga, Delta. Honestly, I don't think I've discussed Delta well enough, considering it's my pet project, and my life's goal, to be fair. So Delta is based in a world where there are only 14 countries, and each is named after their respective language's word for divination. They also have roots of British culture mixed in with their, with their country's natural culture because since I'm British I know more about British culture than I do any other culture so either way it's gonna have a little bit of British culture in there just because that's what I'm used to so hopefully you guys will enjoy that but because of this all English speaking countries within the comic are united as one major country but for this story we go to Uranai which is this world's version of Japan where technology has been abandoned due to the war between civilians and in the Emperor's forces about said ruler's cruel experiments that created the Cyborgs, a series of four humans with cybernetic enhancements inside and out that make them superhuman. 1,000 years after the war is won and the Cyborgs were destroyed, Subasa, who is the descendant of the, of the scientist who created the Cyborgs, goes in search of a device that gives the humans the same inhuman strengths the cyborgs had. This was created after the last cyborg was invented, but it was never tested. However, he is stopped along the way by the Hewa no Umi mercenary group led by Noritaka, who will stop at nothing to halt Tsubasa's progress. With, it, with the device in the enemy's hands, Tsubasa retreats into the desolate lab to find a capsule holding the only remaining cyborg inside. Never activated, therefore never found by mankind. This cyborg is C-A-I-Y-A Delta, or Kaya, as she is referred to by Subasa. This story is about Kaya's growth from machine to human, and there are a fair few obstacles along the way, one of which only she can face in a fair fight. Anyway, that's it from me today. I hope you guys enjoyed my little summary and the video alongside it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next week for another one.